Good morning and welcome to sunny and clear Winnipeg. Probably about 15 minutes ago I was outside the front door and I, uh, I've got the, uh, the screen open on the front door so I could hear Missy barking and I knew, I knew she was just right outside my door. And I go outside and my neighbor's out there with Missy and uh, Missy's barking to let me know that she wants her, her, her dog cookie. Uh, for those of you who don't know, I I generally try to keep at least one of these little cookies in, in my in my uh, pocket. <laughs> I, I had two, now there's only one. I only give her one at a time. Anyway, I was out there and he was saying it's going to be 23 degrees today and sunny. And then he adds, good day for a bike ride. <laughs> well, that's for sure. Okay, um, now as for what are we going to do today on the model? Black truck. I don't know. Did, did he wait for me to push record? <laughs> I didn't time it. Uh, anyway. Okay. Uh, yeah, it's uh, step 48 <clears throat> is almost identical to step 47, except that it's a uh, mirror image. We're looking at the other side now. I'm probably not going to video any of it because it's, it's stuff that we've already done. Uh, you know, just more more little ladders here and, and more little short pieces of railing. Uh, like I say, they're, they're pretty much identical to what we've already put on this side. So I'm going to have to turn the ship around here and uh, I think I'm just going to try and quickly do it off camera. <clears throat> I've also got some errands to run today. I discovered first thing this morning. Oh, speaking of first thing this morning. Uh, I woke up early again. Not quite as bad as the... When I woke up at 2.30, uh, what was it, 48 hours ago, or was it 72 hours ago? It doesn't matter. Anyway, well, this morning I woke up and it was 3.30, so that's a little better, but it was another one of those mornings. I just knew that I wasn't going to go back to sleep, so I got up. Now, oh, I did see something interesting in the monitor. I'll show you later. Uh, and as far as the sunrise goes, goes, I checked that out. It's uh, very, very plain because it's just a clear sky, no clouds. But maybe I'll do a time lapse thing of the way it was and stick it at the end of today's episode. It'll help lengthen the episode. Otherwise, uh, if I include it right now, uh, yeah, this is going to be a short episode. I'm looking for all kinds of excuses to, you know, stretch it out. Um, and yet, on the other hand, who says they have to be, uh, have to be long, you know? Um, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna get going here and, uh, try and get something done. Uh, like I mentioned, I, I gotta, I gotta go, I got an errand to run, I gotta, I ran out of milk. So, uh, went online this morning and ordered some milk. It'll be ready to pick up at 10.30. Now, mind you, I did order a few other things as well. Uh, but it saves me having to go into the store. I just drive up to the place to the door there and call them on my cell phone and say I'm here and they, they bring it out to me. And they only charge a dollar extra. <laughs> and yeah, it saves me having to wander around in the store and see a whole bunch of stuff that uh, I shouldn't be eating. Okay, uh, yeah, let's uh, let's let's get going here. Uh, you know, I sh I should have bought that milk when I drove right past the store yesterday. What's the matter with me? Uh, I, sh I should make a list, you know, of things to, that I have to do, and I always have that list with me. And, uh, okay, let's uh, let's get going here. Get some parts down. Get our model turned around. Um, and we'll we'll, uh, we'll see you when we see you. I'm guessing it was about an hour after I got up this morning. I was sitting in front of my computer, the one that has the surveillance monitor directly above it, 
And as I'm sitting there checking my email, I notice movement in the surveillance monitor. And I look up and here's a, I think it's a fox. Oh, it could be a coyote. <laughs> chasing a couple of rabbits. Now, if I go behind my shed and look this morning, am I going to find a bunch of rabbit fur? <laughs> I hope not. I really hope not. Okay. We're moving right along here. I've only got three more pieces to put on, as near as I can tell, and then step 48 is done. But I'm starting to make really silly mistakes. And what happened was, when I was trying to glue one of, the, one of the small pieces of railing down, I was leaning against this hoop. And I was sort of using it as a steady rest, I guess, and I wasn't thinking too much about it. And then I hear this sort of a snap. And uh, what I had done was, I had pushed the hoop up against the, the radar unit here. And you can see it's, it's loose now. Now, I, I, I have checked it out. It's going, it's going to be a fairly easy fix. It only, it didn't bend. It only broke off where it's connected together with the CA glue. So I should be able to fix it. Uh, being as the position it's in, I don't know. I might have to rig up some sort of a jig or something. Uh, uh, <laughs> and I, I dropped some CA glue on the deck. <laughs> you know, I'm not, I'm not, uh, uh, you know, going to lose my temper and throw the whole thing in the garbage or anything like that. It's sort of part of the deal. Another thing I was thinking about something that Stephen the Model Shed had said, I think it was in his last episode of his Bismarck build. And he said that when the ship starts to look like this, you have the tendency to think you're almost done. Speaking of almost done, my meatloaf that I put in the oven is, is, I have to go check on it. So I'm going to push stop here and I'll, I'll be back after I check and see if it needs more time or not. Okay, we're back. I turned the oven off, but I'm going to leave the meatloaf in there and let the rice and, that I put in there kind of absorb all the tasty goodness <laughs> okay so uh, yeah the ship's starting to look like it's done and and when we flip the page we're gonna start working on the, the main turrets I had, I had thought we'd be flipping the page here right about now but uh, uh, it, it never goes as fast as you think it's gonna and there is a long way to go yet uh, yeah it's not gonna be done this week that's for sure but I think it might be done by the time that We've had the first snow, uh, maybe. Anyway, but speaking of first snow, uh, I've got my front windows open. It, it's beautiful out there. Right now it's, it, it's 26.2 in the shade. Uh, <laughs> at least that's what it says. Uh, okay, I'm, I'm gonna call her quits and take advantage of this nice weather. And, uh, and I'll go at this later. Uh, Anyway, uh, I'll, I'll put the, I haven't done today's sunrise yet, but I will. Uh, it's going to be all right. Well, I'll put it in at the end of the episode here. Uh, thanks for watching, everybody. Uh, oh, and by the way, I did not go and check to see if there was uh, any rabbit remnants behind the shed. <laughs> the rabbit probably got away. Yeah, I think they have a burrow or something back there, and once they get into their burrow, I don't think the foxes will try to get them out, uh, or whatever that was. Maybe, maybe there's a coyote. I couldn't tell. Maybe you guys, maybe you guys know. It doesn't really matter. Uh, thanks for watching, everybody. All being well, we're gonna see you tomorrow.